Latino spokesman for Trump. A former Marine Corps veteran voted for Bernie last year in June and proudly voted Trump in November. I don't get it when there's all these motherfuckers that say you know, Latinos are standing up against Trump, against his racist ways. I've called um, a few people up that I know, Latinos. Oh, they dig Trump. Not all of them, but I've, uh, I've uh, spoken with some Latinos that uh, like him. Me, I'm just a small businessman. Content with uh, holding myself accountable for my success and failures. It's not government, it's not the white man, it's me, my choices. The uh, influence I've uh, let other people have, have over me. And it's been it's been a learning process. Fuck it, you know, but I could have made better choices here and there. I could go into the whole bunch of what ifs, right? But five minutes complaining is five minutes wasted. Even though it does sort of sound like I'm complaining here, but shit. I'd rather spend time drawing, sketching, than playing the victim. And uh, I would rather let the record show that uh, I am not a victim. I fuck up and I succeed. And I really feel that I'm the spokesman for the average motherfucker. A lot of motherfuckers that, uh, they haven't realized yet, realized it, realized it yet, that they are the ones designing their life. pointless to blame Trump or uh, what's white privilege? Is that shit the feminists are always trying to fight about? Patriarchy, patriarchy. Yeah, so. I say that I'm the spokesman for Latinos simply because I don't want some other motherfucker that's out of touch, that hasn't fucking been to the fucking hoods that I've been to across uh, North America. And, uh,. I'm not a fucking rat either. But just seeing shit, seeing crime, thinking, you know, why did that motherfucker do that? Oh. 
Why do you sell crack? Why do you sling rock? People want it. Okay, good enough. Good answer. I believe it was. I'm trying to think of uh, El Chapo's uh, business partner. I forget his name. But anyways, uh, there's a photo of him going around that states. If they kill me tomorrow, nothing changes. And I thought beautiful, beautiful words. Because even if you smoke his ass or arrest him, you're still gonna be careless parents not give me a buck where the fuck their kids are. And there's still gonna be people being raised Or, um, <clears throat> with a poor sense of self esteem, a poor sense of honor, easy to fall to peer pressure. That's just so gonna go on. When it comes to drugs, man, I would like to see all that shit legalized, all of it. I was doing the, the maths the other day. And I thought, fucking, I could save money and time by buying the McPick 2 and the big, uh, McDonald's um, Big Macs, two Big Macs for five bucks, compared to what I spend on steak vegetables and preparing it. But why the fuck would I want to put that fucking Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtle meat in my body if I really, 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 really don't have to? And I've done it on the road and yes, I do get the um, McDonald's munchies at times. But if I could put less shit on my body some more vegetables. I think I'll do that. I prefer to do that. And I recommend, uh, if you disagree with me, to make your own YouTube video. Say why well, I'm a dumbass, wrong, sellout, whatever. But me, I've seen enough fucking crime, corruption, carelessness, recklessness, to realize that it's us fucking up. No, 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 it's the white man, man, it's the white man. You know, they're the ones that told me to um, not wear rubber and impregnate this bitch. This fucking psychopath that's uh, cleaning me out of divorce court. Yeah, 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 it's not the, uh, the out-of-touch uh, justice system in favor of women. So yeah, if I succeed or if I fail, it's up to me. It's my choice. My choice. No, dog, it's not, dog. It's, um, it's not your fault. It's, um, it's Trump's fault.
And to everyone out there that's uh, not making fucking excuses, not playing the blame game, making shit happen, fuck man, keep at it, motherfuckers, keep at it. Make America great again. Stay strong, keep focused, go forward. Because that's all we can do. And uh, speak your mind. Speak it. This one fucking Hillary supporter uh, who wasn't a fucking veteran. Fucking junkie, low life. You know, I probably would be drawing more videos if I wasn't so uh, caught up uh, trying to train my dogs and walking them because they're puppies. So it's all it's all energy, you know. And socialize them. You know, try to smack them a little bit, not, not, not fucking beat them down, smack them. You know, because they got uh, fuck, a powerful weapon in their mouth, you know. You know, treat them good, repetition over and over. Take them to the vet to get them the shots. And that's just a fucking animal. I could imagine if I had a kid, you know, how much planning I would do. Fuck, I, I probably would give up drawing. It's likely I would have to give up drawing. Man, I've just seen so many fucking reckless parents just not give a fuck. Yeah, go hang out with your buddy. Be back at 11, cool. You know, it's all good, you know, nothing, um, I showed them, um, the honor system by watching <laughs> Toy Story 1, 2, is there a 3? I think there is. And, uh, yeah, it should be fine. Yeah, you know, I try to teach the dogs, yes, no, sit, let's go already, um, to minimize the risk of them biting someone, minimize the risk of them going out into the fucking street and get run over, minimize the chance of them shitting uh, in my home, minimize the chance of, um, what other shit? Fucking, uh, chasing someone's basketball when you're playing. Oh, man, it's such a big responsibility. Man, when I see people just. The kids run around. Fucking experimenting, uh, whatever someone else brought into their fucking life to smoke. Ideas. Put stupid ideas in their heads. I've seen kids run around with fucking here in Los Angeles. Run around with uh, guns. Kids. 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 
and eat me yeah, up. Man, I'm tired of that. I really just hate seeing the youth go to waste. They're eventually going to bring it to the wrong house. Run into the wrong cop. The wrong business owner, or even worse, he could just keep getting uh, away with their crimes. I like watching uh, Cesar Milan Dog Whisperer. Old episodes and it's more recent stuff. And um, go along his methods of teaching dogs. But I wonder how many parents even find parents that they admire or look up to to teach their, their own offspring. And again, this is just a fucking dog, a dog, a puppy that I'm training. But now for them, I want them to live a, a happy life. Meet more dogs, meet people, get treats. Wow, just what, what a responsibility if I had kids. What a responsibility. 